So, you are ready to start cooking today? What are we making? What are we making? Aliolio! Aliolio! La 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 olio! Aglio e olio. Olive oil and garlic oh, in Italian. And I've added shrimp. For me, this recipe is so fun and it's one of my most favorites because I went to Italy with my sweet husband and our dear, dear friends, the Dursos, and we went to Montecatini Alto. We were at this small, incredible restaurant and they kept bringing me dishes, bringing everybody dishes. And I was so excited, I couldn't wait for my first pasta. In Italy. In Italy, and they brought this little dish and it was nothing but noodles. And it looked so boring, it just looked like buttered noodles. And I was so like, I remember in my head, I thought, oh, darn, there's no sauce, no nothing. All the way to Italy. Right, for what? So I did a little twirl, I put that puppy in my mouth and it was like, Nirvana, it was Nirvana, it was amazing. I was asking them, How, what is this? You know, what is this? Right. How do I make it? And she didn't like, have Google no, Translate. No, I don't know. Yeah. And I'm like, Ito, eat <laughs> good. What are the ingredients? No. What's in there? So I went home and uh, I just tried very hard to figure it out. It's very, very simple. Uh, but don't back off on the salt, okay? On the on the layers of the different rich saltiness. That's what makes the dish. So what I've already done is I um, I used uh, better than bouillon in my water, uh, toss some olive oil on top, and I, I'm boiling that up, and then I'll throw my pasta in. So the first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna get our breadcrumbs ready. You're the, almost like the last thing to go on your product. Um, but so they're the first thing you're going to make and then set it aside so that it's all ready. And all I've done is I've um, melted, I've melted this yummy two tablespoons of butter right in that yummy copper pan. And now I've got about a quarter cup of breadcrumbs. Pour that in there. I'm going to brown that up. Toast, just toast them. And this by itself is worth the price of admission. It will make anything taste fabulous! While that's toasting up, I'm gonna add our two tablespoons of Fustini's. Fire that puppy right up. This is such a fantastic dish. It's very quick, very easy, and it makes you look like a star. And now, this should be heating up. Mm -hmm. I'm back here smashing those eight cloves of garlic <laughs> and have to toss them around the kitchen. <laughs> All right, so now I have my beautiful flat anchovies. Yummy, yummy, yummy. So what you want to do is you're just going to put those yummy anchovies right into that water. It's oil, oil, oil. Melts right into the oil. It's a little sizzly. <laughs> Literally melt right into the oil because we don't want anybody to get one big old chunk of anchovy. You don't even, you don't even have to tell them it's in there. So don't let the anchovies scare you away. I know you'll be scared, but feel the fear and do it anyway. <laughs> okay? And trust me, I'm not a big fan of anchovies and they are delicious. Yeah, it's, you won't even know it. You won't even know that they're in there. Okay, my breadcrumbs are done. See how yummy that is? They're just perfectly browned and they taste delicious. So now we're gonna set those aside. I got this beautiful handful of fresh garlic that Barry just smashed. I'm gonna saute that now. Put that in there with the anchovies. <laughs> oh, I wish we could smell over the bone. It's so good. I'm putting yeah. the Victoria's Taylor yeah, oh, we got Sicilian, I'm gonna say a tablespoon, okay? And now we're gonna put, this is to your taste level, red cracked pepper. So if you like it hot, put a lot. If you like a little, put a little. <laughs> you know what I mean? Just a few little shakes. Now I put the shrimp in there, and it just, very gently saute them. 
you got to stay right on this because you don't want to cook them all the way through. A few precious, precious people who can't, can't tolerate gluten. So we've got some gorgeous rice pasta for them. Got a separate pan for them, separate wonderful pan to boil their rice noodles in. And the rest of us are eating the gluten. Butoni, <laughs> yummy, fresh noodles. They're so good and they're done super quick. So what I like to do is put them in there all at once. Ta-da! While they're in there, I'm gonna swirl some butter in there. And the sauce. In the sauce. And then two tablespoons of butter. I'm gonna swirl that around in there. Now we have this beautiful pasta, okay? And I like to get some of the pasta water mixed in with it. Now we'll let that sizzle, fry up. All right, so I'm gonna toss the shrimp right on in there. Mm, some of that shrimpy juice. Toss that right in there. And now, then we follow that up with the Parmesan. Oh, great, some bunch of Parmesan. I'm gonna turn it off. Six and a half hours later. Cheese, lots of cheese. Now we have to try this magical, 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 yummy pasta dish. <laughs> oh, mm. Mm. Mm, that is so good. I mean, it tastes so spicy and then the mm. yummy, delicious, salty and mm, the breadcrumbs. They do, they have a little crunch. Yeah, go after it. Ah, oh, they're really good. Do a little twirl. I mean, it's just an explosion of yummy flavor in your mouth. It's the perfect amount of spiciness, tempered by the smoothness of the butter. The saltiness is not too much. And the Don't nuttiness you think? of the parmesan. Uh -huh. Like the, the crunchiness of the, the breadcrumbs at the end. Perfect. <laughs> so I think you should make this. It's super easy. It'll make you famous. Thanks for joining us. We'll see you next week. Yeah, come, come on. on back. We might Bye. get a new name. Come on back. Yeah. You gotta hit that thumbs uh -huh. up. Like below thumbs at the up. bottom, there's a okay. bunch of stuff which mm -hmm. I had to find myself. I'm and not being like greedy or like anything. This and a thumb like that. Uh -huh. Hit this thumb. And then if you go over <laughs> a little bit to the side, there's right. a word that says su that's subscribe. Right. Says to subscribe. Mm -hmm. yeah, it should be in right. red. It's in red. <laughs> subscribe in red. Right? And so click on that. Like our lipstick. Yes, and then you can be part of our YouTube channel. We mm -hmm. like that. Please mm -hmm. join us. We would love it.